Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. So I decided today, while well, I have some time, and before I put it away with my other filled journals, I figured I'd do a flip through of my last journal journal I just completed on Tuesday. Sorry, I blanked there for a minute. And yeah. This is journal number 27. She got pretty chunky. So, yeah. I may have to do this in a couple parts. I don't know. It just depends on how long I do this. But yeah, that's the journal. And I figured I'd show you guys what my new journal is. This is going to be my new journal. I started it yesterday. Do more of what makes you awesome. I got it from Michaels. And I figured it'd be fun and kind of springish to start because of the colors. It's got 96 pages. So yeah, with further ado, let's get into it. I might not talk much about what's going on in the days because not a whole lot happened, but I just figured I'd show you guys. I'm going to put it up this way a little bit because of the fact that there is personal stuff in here and I don't want to put it on the earth. So as you guys see, this is journal number 27. I started it on January 1st of 2021 and I finished it February or er, April 6th of 2021. So it took me four months. So, yeah. And sorry if I move too long. Like I said, I don't know where my tripod is. And so, yeah. Alright. So this was New Year's Eve. As you guys could see, cheers to a new year. But yeah. I'm trying to get where I won't show too much of my writing because, like I said, it's personal. And there's whoop, that. So, yeah, I won't do too much chalk. Talking, just flipping through. Excuse my cat if you hear him. <clears throat> He's very boisterous. As you guys see, I usually do magazine clipping, stickers, and washi. I did a Taylor Swift spread because. I love Taylor Swift. Dolly Parton. Parton. I love her. And there's a Carrie Underwood spread. <laughs> Alright, this was um on On, guys. Huh. This was Naya Rivera's birthday, so I did a spread decade to her for she was spinning her because she's in heaven and yeah. It says happily happy heavenly birthday, and she t was supposed to be to thirty four. Um, yeah. Bittersweet. More writing. This was whenever we started having a lot of the cold, snowy weathers.
And this was a New Year's card from Julianne. I'm going to put the washi she sent and kind of just dedicate a page to her. I'm going to put right there. Thank you, Julianne. <laughs> Here's February. Another card from Julianne, which was her Valentine's Day card. I'm sorry I never got one to you this year, Julianne. There's just been a lot going on that it's hard to explain. But I'm hoping next year things will be a little more settled and everything. And I'll be able to send out your card. You a card. But I'll make it up to you sometime, I promise. This is from Amanda. The day before Valentine's Day. On Valentine's Day. And I guess I was going on because it was supposed to be Valentine's Day. But yet it didn't feel like it. Because about this whole week here, we're having negative temperatures every single day. And that was a pain in the butt. And I liked that. I put 22 was a mess. Clean it up. And it came with that toilet paper there. Or. Er. Paper towels. I don't know. I just thought it was pretty cool. Because it was a mess. Another pink spread. This was a very, very good day. It was a lot of fun, and I wrote five pages about it, so, yeah. Those of you that talk to me in the journaling chat group, or personally know why, so, yeah. I kind of did a cut. Dog and cat spread, pet spread. Here's, um, 12, I think. I don't know, my mind's blank, but I know who these people are. They're a K, it's a K-pop group that I like. And I liked it. And then I started warming up. Something about the COVID-19 vaccine. Some facts and stuff I put in here about it. Let's see. Their questions answered, which was questions about it and everything. And at that time, I was nervous because I was going to get the vaccine. In a few week days, which I probably wrote about in here. To the stars. Just. Yeah. Oh, we started to work on the house. Our house that we're remodeling that we bought and I was just really sore and tired then we got March and this is when the weather really started turning around so I started putting spring stuff in Yeah. And then 
saying farewell to Larry King, who passed away. So I figure I put that in there. And just more writing. Some washi samples I got because we went to a Dollar Tree about 30 minutes away and they had washi tape. So those are some of the washi samples I got from it. Then a picture of Harry and Meghan Markle. Which I really thought that was a pretty picture. And here's a COVID-19 update. Two months after the COVID shot. Something will now, will, new virus variants delay an end to the pandemic. So I cut that part out somehow. I think it was like fallout, full out or something like that. And it's just some questions. Some more questions. Are the COVID-19 vaccines updates and stuff it's beginning to look a lot like spring because it was and I put perfume samples in here and that's the perfume sample and it smells really good sorry for the wrinkly I just it just wasn't cooperating with me that day then I did a Taylor Swift thing because a Taylor's triumphant return for whenever she, um, uh, what was it? She did, uh, she's starting to do some of her old songs in her own version. And, um, on February 11th, she released a version of her love story that she done Taylor's version so I'm pretty proud of her about that sorry guys there's a cat spread I thought that was really cute and then I did a thing on Taylor Momsen if you guys don't know who she is she plays Cindy Lou Who in The Grinch, which is right here, and she's a lead singer to a band I like called Pretty Reckless, so that's why I did a whole thing on her. See, there's her when she was a kid, and Gossip Girl and stuff. I just cut it out. And this was St. Patrick's Day. Obviously. <laughs> Some washi samples because I ordered a bunch of washi tape. And so I put the samples in here. So you guys could see them a little bit. There's a little tip in I did. Yeah, just a bunch of springish and stuff washy because I needed some. It was a rainy day. And then I cut out the thing about the Texas deadly freeze. Where Texas was in a deadly freeze around the time that all these negative temperatures and stuff were going on. It was in one of the magazines I cut out, so I decided to put it on there. And it's got, by the numbers, negative two temperatures in Dallas on February 16th. A low not seen since 1949. 4.3 million Texas homes without power on February 16th. 14.9 million Texans without safe drinking water on February 19th. So those of you, if there's any subscribers from Texas and stuff, I hope you guys are doing fine now. And you were in my prayers and everything whenever this all this was going on. So yeah, I did facts about it right there. And 
and just lots of writing. COVID-19, one year later, what to know now? A year later, which was on their year anniversary since COVID-19 hit. And so I did the stuff on here. Excuse me, kitty. It's my cat, Sparky. He likes to be in the way of things when I'm trying to do stuff. And I just cut out the... And just put it in here. News article and stuff. Because it'd be fun to read back on. <sighs> Sorry guys. And then I did another perfume sample spread. And this is the perfume. Prada. And it smells really good. It makes my journal smell good too. And yeah, just... Lots of writing. And then there's um, the Karate Kid. A little article about him. The Karate Kid's Ralph Macchio at 59. So there you go. The Karate Kid and Cobra Kai. I like those movies, and I said I watched, um, I watched Cobra Kai the first couple of episodes, and that was really good. So I'm wanting to finish watching it. And I did another Carrie Underwood spread. Just random writing. Some new pens I got that I put in here from the Dollar Tree and some washi samples that I got that day in the mail. Yeah, just like lots of writing. Unicorn spread. Then I put the article about the Atlanta Georgia spa shooting aftermath just something to look back on what happened remembering the lives lost and there's just stuff about it so yeah then I got some more washi tape samples from today that I got in the mail. From, well that's from that day. So yeah, now the weather just started being pretty. So yeah. And then on March 30th was the release date of Wonder Woman 1984. I think is what it's called. And it came out on DVD and Blu-ray and all that stuff on this day on March 30th. So I did a little spread about it. And we pre-ordered it, which today... In the mail, we got it, so I'm pretty excited to watch it. Mm, writing, April, spring at last. And then there went, and then there was yet another mass shooting in Boulder, Colorado, which sucked. So I had to put that in here. And. Yeah. And those are the people who lost their lives in that. Plus a police officer, as you can see the arrows here. And then the shooter. Prayers goes out to that family. To the family members of those who lost their lives in that. So yeah. And then... These are washi samples I got from Michael's. You guys seen my haul. 
when I went shopping at Michael's, and here's the washi samples I put in there for it. Okay. And then I did a thing about Bendy, Chandler and ben, Bendy's baby Joy. So I did that. And I put congrats to Bendy and Chandler. And then Beverly Clary Pass Away, which sucks. I had to put this in here because I loved her books, especially the Ramona ones. And then here's Easter. Which I wrote four pages about that. And then I did this thing about Demi Lovato and surviving her trauma. So I had to put that in here because I like some of her music. I'm glad she's doing okay. So yeah. And then I did Life as a Rockstar Mom. Evanescence and Amy Lee, which I love Evanescence. So I had to put this in here too. And lots of writing. And this was the last day. So yeah, I was pretty excited. And then I did a quote right here. Dear reader, you do not know me, but I most certainly know you. Lady whistled on down from Bridgerton, I'm guessing. And then what I done in this journal, I haven't read or watched movies or anything This in this journal, I've been so busy. Some washi samples from all that I used in the whole journal. And then my pen tests and the end. So yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'm sorry this was probably a long video, but I'm sorry I didn't really talk much about what was on, except some things, but I hope you guys enjoy. I hope you guys enjoyed my flip through. Flip through. Sorry, I cannot talk. And um, I hope to see you guys in my next video. Bye. Please, if you like this video, please do like, comment, and subscribe down below. Share me if you can, please. Help me get back up to 60 because that still bothers me. Anyways, thank you all. Love you. Bye.